This video does not condone the use of performance enhancement drugs, and the information provided here is solely for educational purposes only. Hey guys, it's me again, Larry. In this video, I'll be giving you all the information you need on bremelanotide. I'll provide you with the most important pieces of information in this video, so stay tuned. Bremelanotide is a 7-amino acid peptide used to treat hypoactive sexual desire disorder in premenopausal women. PT-141, also called a bremelanotide, generic clinical name, is a heavily modified synthetic derivative of alpha-melanocyte-stimulating hormone. It has been tested in clinical trials as a treatment for both male and female hypoactive sexual desire disorder and acute hemorrhaging. PT-141 is an agonist for the melanocortin-4 and melanocortin-1 receptors. Research shows that it promotes sexual arousal and stimulates the immune system. You may have heard it more commonly referred to as Vialese, Remelanotide, or the sex peptide as it produces a positive sexual response. Other than the enhancement of sexual libido, consumers can also benefit from enhanced energy levels and greater arousal. If you plan to buy this product, it is a must to know its dosage information since this has an effect. Bremelanotide is usually taken at 2 mg and is injectable or sprayed up each nostril. According to a 2016 study, the appropriate dosage for women is between 1.25 mg and 1.75 mg when used as an injection. Dosage can be adjusted if necessary, increasing dosage to 4 mg with two sprays per nostril. Of course, it's important to consult a doctor or health practitioner to advise you on your recommended dosage. Dosage can vary depending on a person's individual medical condition and sexual needs. Some of the main effects and benefits associated with using bremelanotide include anti-cancer properties, anti-inflammatory properties, tanned skin, promotes skin tanning, increases energy levels, Extra benefits for men could include treatment of erectile dysfunction, more frequent erections, general health benefits. Extra benefits for women include treatment of generalized hypoactive sexual desire disorder, vascular congestion, pelvic floor strength, and bremelanotide is great for skin. So I have just enlightened you with the benefits that go along with using bremelanotide. It's now time for us to go over the most common side effects that you will need to be aware of before you consider using this peptide. Side effects associated with this drug include increase in sexual arousal, increased libido, a longer lasting erection, headaches, vomiting, flushing in the face, skin pigmentation, nausea, coughing, congestion in the upper nasal passage, an increase in male blood pressure, a decrease in heart rate, irritation or itchiness around the injection site. Bremelanotide PT-141 is most effective administered via a subcutaneous injection, ideally where there are fat deposits. The more powerful form of the peptide is injectable. Oral pills, nasal sprays, and creams have shown limited effects when compared to injections. Given that everybody responds differently to bremelanotide PT-141, effective dosages may vary. A 2 mg dose is generally effective for men and women about one hour prior to sexual activity. Some studies suggest starting with a 1 mg test dose and injecting an identical amount 30 minutes later. By consulting your Men's Health Institute physician, you can receive a cycle protocol best suited for your condition. In studies, some subjects responded to PT-141 in minutes, while others took several hours to see the effects. Bremelanotide PT-141 is a novel treatment option for sexual dysfunction that works in both men and women. Now we should associate post-cycle therapy when we run this drug. For bremelanotide, it is being researched as a prospective therapy for sex-related problems such as erectile disorder in males, as well as sex-related arousal disorders in females, specifically hypoactive libido problem, HSDD, as well as women's sex-related interest arousal conditions, FSIAD. PT-141 increases your sexual desire by activating the melanocortin-4 receptor in the brain, which normally regulates the metabolism, male erection function, and sexual behavior. Its operating mechanism typically involves action in your central nervous system, CNS, instead of directly on the cardiovascular system. That's all, everyone. This has been your friend, Larry. 
Consult with a health expert on a regular basis before deciding to take peptides. Go easy until my next video.